Yes, guys, welcome back to another episode of the Good Enough Podcast. Hello. How are you, mate? Hello. My it's mouth's big... on fire, bruv. Yeah, so so quick quick one before we start. We went to this little Caribbean spot, obviously. It weren't even nice. Speci- nah, specialty, specialty. It for weren't me. nice, bruv. No, no, no. As in, it's just my little lane because I'm Caribbean. It weren't that nice. Bit flavorless, I can't lie. It was shit. But Johnny saw a red sauce. And no, hot thought, sauce. I thought, I, no, like, he, I like spice in it, yeah? He, he assumed it was hot sauce. I thought sauce. it was in Kona, hot pepper sauce. Yeah, like, and that's calm. You that's put that, nice. it's got good, good, good taste. Nice little kick. Turns the bottle around, it's Carolina Reaper sauce. Ghost pepper sauce. To be, to be fair though, why have they got that in the front of the fucking shop? Bro, I, could, like, I was sitting there sweating bad. Who bro. looks at it and goes, yeah, I'll have a bit of Carolina Reaper on my jerk chicken? I had to get the fucking producers to turn the aircon on. I was sitting there sweating, bro. <laughs> yeah. No joke, bro. It's fucking red hot, bro. Yeah, and joke. it's done my gut now. My, my gut is going... He's going to be on the bog for two hours when he goes home. Word. But when um, one's in it, it just falls out. <laughs> just falls out. Speaking of food, yeah, what would be one food you could... you Like, if you had to eat one food for the rest of your entire life, what would it be? And... Let's not say food is in like one item, like banana, like, like a, meal, a, a meal, a meal, a meal, a meal. Should we do? Should we do one breakfast meal? Yes, breakfast and a dinner meal. Don't dinner, because lunch, lunch is just lunch is just what well, sandwich. Sandwich. Breakfast. It's a full English, isn't it? Do you reckon? Yeah. yeah. You can feel shit after that. Those. I love. I love a full English, bro. Sausages, bacon, mm. eggs. There's a banging caffeine and rice slip. Yeah. Oh my days. It's 10, 10, and it, it's not, you know them calves that ain't greasy? Yeah, just so, it's I, clean, bro. When like, I was younger, good. my dad made me think it's better if there's bare buildings in the calf, and it's like- I was literally gonna say, what, like workers' calf. You see, like, you go workers' calf, you see like- Come out stinking bare in Greece. Fucking, what do you call stink. it? Just like 20 man in hivers is, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sitting in there before the, before the job starts. Stinks of oil, and, and the breakfast is six quid. I you know. get bare shit. I know. <laughs> black two pudding, toast on the side, black yeah, pudding, black, two toast. Lot. Yeah, but you come out stinking, stinking bruv. of oil. Stinking of grease, bruv. You come out stinking a lot of gaffs. If you go to a curry house, you come out stinking. Yeah, you come out stinking as well, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's jank. Um, yeah, breakfast full English. For me though, 100%. Cause... Full English, yeah. I think sometimes when I eat it full English, do you know what I've gone off bare? Eggs. Love eggs. Come on, man. No. You, are, you a fried, are you a fried man or a scramble man? Any. Or? I used to like any. But now, now, for some reason, it's just like, you know what it is, yeah? <laughs> you actually feel sick. No, it's because, you know what it is? When I get a full English, yeah? I've now stopped getting eggs. Right. Because when I'm eating a full English, yeah? See, as you're getting so far, do you have chips with your English? No. Oh, you've got to have not. chips. No man. way. No way. Why? Chips bro, and that's beans. A, that's a lunchtime or dinner meal. No, chips and beans, bang. Chips in the morning for me is, is strenuous, bro. No, I'm chip, having chips eggs, and beans. eggs scrambled. Yeah. Yeah, tell me, tell me your, your Scra- full English. Scramble the eggs. Scramble Scrambled them. Don't the give egg. me no fried egg. Or if you are going to give it to me, scrambled in a sure... microwave or f- fried no, no. Like, like scrambled in a pan. pan. Yeah, 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 but like, you know. If you're gonna give it to me fried, make sure that the the sunny side, the sun is is nice and loosey goosey. So yeah, I can yeah, yeah, yeah. Dip yeah, my yeah. stuff in yeah, there, yeah? yeah. But pr- preferably scrambled, yeah. The thought of egg. Couple know. Cumberland sausages on the side, chilling, waiting for me, yeah. <sighs> Streaky bacon, make sure that shit's crispy. Streaky, not str- sorry, crispy. Make crispy. sure it's crispy. Don't give yeah, me that loose yeah, yeah, hanging yeah, shit. Yeah, 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 I need yeah. it crispy. Can't be like yeah? something. Yeah, <laughs> literally. You know, beef curtains and that. Allow <laughs> me. <laughs> like, um. <coughs> What else? Beans. Have to. I think beans are all time top body to fucking beans dish. For breakfast. You can have beans with anything. Yeah, you can. You can. And um, a bit of toast on the side or a nice little coffee and tea. That's it. Yeah, I'd say mine is double sausage, double bacon. Yeah, you have to. Usually double egg, chips, beans, hash brown. That's heavy though. Chips and hash brown, I'm taking out. I think that's why. Crazy. Yeah, but I can eat, man. I think that's why. When I get to the end of it, you like still, I, I get everything on my fork, innit? That's what I like doing. Like, okay, like yeah, scraping yeah, up the beans. Bit, bit, bit. When I get near the end and all I can taste in my mouth is the egg, it makes you go like, 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 and I walk out the cafe and I'm burping and all I can taste is egg. egg. And it's just like, Ugh. So would you not put full English as your, as your... No, what would I put? If I had to eat one meal for the... Yeah, but you'd be getting bare unhealthy from that, brother, as well. Eggs are a source of protein. So beans has got good, good... No, beans is, beans is. Beans on toast slaps. Sausage is... You know what it is? I'm going protein. off at the minute. At the minute, I'm not really eating hot breakfast. I like cold breakfast. Well, so like when I'm waking up, I'm feeling really like angry that. and annoyed. Like, because where the way it's like, like, cold at the minute. Cold at the Wake up, I'm like... Mm. And that in my room, yeah, the loft extension, fucking... I've got V-Lux windows. So literally, the light will come through on my eye, and I'm like, "Oh my days, yeah. bro!" And I go downstairs, and I just think I could not think of stomach and anything hot right now. So I've got something cold. Um, what would I eat for breakfast for life? For life, bro. It, 
does it have health effects or is it just genuine? Like no, this? let's 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 just rule it out and say it doesn't affect your health. Okay, right now I've probably got a sausage sandwich. Bear that's butter, nice. And that's bear all right. butter, bear ketchup. That's right. Yeah, that's a nice little. Yeah, yeah. But you got to cut the sausages in well, half as no well. Bacon in there as well. Nah, yeah, not bacon. Of course you got. You got to slice that. Bacon and ketchup don't go. Yeah, they do. Brown sauce, brown sauce and ketchup. Okay, uh, and, brown and sauce bacon. and bacon goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or maybe just a little humble little fucking. Crunchy nut cornflake. Nah, Crap. you can't eat Don't that, even bro. fucking. For the rest of your life. Nah, yeah. Lost your mind. Yeah. You gotta put, no, look, it's the rest of your life. So you're just, just know it's Bowl sausage, chips. bread, and butter. I'd put more shit in there. Put bacon in there. Yeah. Even when you're getting sick of it, though. Couple eggs. Yeah, you, you are right. The, you, can, you can take just, the eggs. Today, out I'm just gonna have a sausage. Yeah, literally. <laughs> yeah. So, you know. I don't that. know. Yeah, you've got to I suppose it's full English, isn't it? Got to keep it interesting, it's true. Then you can work it around it. Work it around. You could just one day have chips and beans. There you, you know go. what I mean? There you go. Yeah. What about dinner? Dinner of fuck. Man's eating steak. Do you know what? It sounds mad. I've like out of all the great meals that I've had, there's only one meal that Don't say Caribbean food, bruv. No, it's not Caribbean. Why not though? Because that's all you ever say, bro. When you yeah, say yeah, but it is milk. though. But no, genuinely, I would say Caribbean you get food. It, you're Jamaican. Yeah, <laughs> get it. Like, like I'm gonna be fish and chips. <laughs> <laughs> I would have Caribbean food, but there's even times where my mum says, oh, "I've made this." You can't this, say your mum's cooking though. You can't say that. No, no, no. Bro, but because your mum's gonna die look, before look, you. Look, look, so look. look, look, look. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you. Something. When, when, when I grew up, yeah, we was we was mad broke in it. So there's a we used to have tuna and rice. As a oh. meal, like it was tuna, but my mum would obviously try to do it up to make it like nice. And then we'd have rice, that's it. Like bro, that's it. So as I've got older now, sometimes my mum will be like, oh yeah, we're having this, we're having that, we're having that. And I'm like, yeah, don't fancy it. But if she says tuna rice, I'll always, I'll really? always have it, always. So you know, you know I deep the other day, yeah, see like really wealthy, wealthy people, like I'm talking about, not like, oh, they got like a couple hundred bags. You're talking like, like- I'm talking about- High ends, like, high yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, And they was born into it, not yeah. like they've made it. Yeah. When you taste them tuna, they expect they think of of the actual tuna, tuna. expensive yeah, sushi yeah, yeah. shit. Yeah. They don't know about no can. They don't know about the can. They don't know tuna. about no can. That open. What do you mean? See the can tuna is banging. But you see when you get a bit on your finger, it smells like, <laughs> what? like, like. Why are you smelling your finger? You have to if you got it on your finger. I'll, I'll tell you that. I've but if I'm cleaning all dishes I've and never... that, and I get a bit on my finger, I have to smell it, bro. I never. I've never have smelled have my to. finger. I have, have to. It smells crazy. like smells like someone's died, and then <laughs> their fucking nun has just gone stagnant, and it's just like. Like, ah, oh, they're also and they're minge mixed together. That's what, that's what tuna's from. <laughs> like, that shitty, pooey, pooey, pooey funny. Like backwind. Pooey funny, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what it smells like. It's disgusting, bro. I love it. Tuna mm. rice, bro, I'm going for that. That's, that's, that's my meal, but it's more of a comforting thing to me. That like, I'll yeah. always say yes to it if my mum says she's made it. Yeah. Uh, what would I have for life? So for life, you'd have tuna and rice? Yeah. yeah. Fuck Je off, bro. No, bro, I swear to God. Obviously, my, mom, my, 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 my mum's not in the same hole she was in back back then. Yeah, she's, she's got a bit of scratch now, isn't it? So we can not make the, death row, we mate. can make the nice meals. Yeah, I promise you, my mum can tell me we're having this, we're having that. Yeah, and I get so, it. I sometimes get it. I genuinely won't be on it. But you know, she said so we, me and my sister, we request for her to cook tuna rice, and she's like, "Why cook it? What does she cook it? She has to the way my mum does it, the tuna." She does that. Oh, Seasons You just got to yeah, know, yeah. like, you got to see, you got to just, you get yeah, me peppers yeah, yeah. in there. Fucking. Oh, yeah, yeah. So it's, onions, not just, the, it's not just. It's just tuna. Uh, it's not just. Not just <laughs> and then rice. Don't up the tuna. Okay, that's what I thought it stuff. was. Yeah, I was going to say, it's that's like, what you in the can. Now nah, she judged like, it. She judged it up. Yeah. She judged it. You would do well in jail then, wouldn't it? Of course. Fucking hell, bro. You'd be thriving. Course, I'd be thriving. You don't want a mackerel. What mackerel? What we used to bang that as well, bro? Mackerel's disgusting. I like it. I love it. Because, because. In the tomato juice. I love it. I'll eat that. No, I can't eat that. I'd, I'd thrive in jail, bro. One meal for the rest of my life. It'd probably be something Asian. I like yeah, Asian you, food you, you a lot, proper, man. You proper like Asian um, food. Maybe. Something uh, Thai. Thai, 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 Thai but then this, yeah, maybe. Like, a, like a, a curry, a Thai curry. Yeah, I could eat that. So, yeah. That's lovely. You would, that's your lane. Thai curry, yeah. Or like, it, just, it all depends what you fancy in the moment, really. Yeah, Because right now I'm thinking of eating a Thai curry. I, I don't got, like, like couldn't eat that. I just had rice and chicken. Yeah. What I could slap right now is Nando's. Could you? Yeah. I couldn't even dream chicken of and that chips. right now after that. Chicken and chips. I can't lie. Perry chicken and chips. Sometimes even when it's not Nano's, when it's like a little knockoff shop. Oh, mate. And the chips are really skinny. And I, you, man, someone genuinely, I'd say, especially if you're between the ages of like 16 to 21, yeah? I know you lot have gone Pepe's. Yeah, of course. Like, I think it's overrated. They bang it. Oh, brother. It's nice. But do you know what it is? The rice See, box. 
No, there's I've a, seen, there's a I've seen me them, on Oxbridge I've Road, I've seen yeah. them raving about on, on TikTok, the rice box. I said, let me try that. There's a better one. <laughs> it's stupid. Is it nice? Oh my God. There's a protein box on some chicken shop on Oxbridge Road by me, yeah? yeah. All the, everything else in the, in the shop is too much light. It's not nice. Right. But the protein box is 10 out of 10. It's just diced chicken, rice, and uh, onion. I love onions. Yeah, I same, love onions, yeah. like raw onions. Yeah, because you're good, good flavor. Bang Mixed it. I probably wouldn't eat it. Wait, do you just eat onions? Not like an apple. Oh, so yeah, you put like, it in... I, I could do, yeah. Nah. Not a whole onion. It, I need it in stinking, bruv. <laughs> you, like, you know, like when you get like a Turkish, yeah? And you and get like onions, onions lettuce. lettuce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Bang him. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe something with... If I didn't put on weight, probably something with chips. Chicken nice. and chips. Uh, just, just straight Chicken carbs. And chips. Bear sauce over it, bruv. Like bear perry sauce in it. Anyone ever been Lebanese grill? Oh my God, I've got to take you. I've had Lebanese food. That's one thing we'll go for. I've had food. Or... Yeah, I've had Lebanese food. Lamb. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Banging. Yeah, my like, shits like, were stinking after that. Lamb get around that. Yeah, yeah, my shits were stinking, bruv, after that. I can't lie. So, yeah, you They're look... stinking, bruv. Like, like, it smelled like fermented grass. It's worth it. Yeah, it smelled like your <laughs> shits in Napa. Oh! Yeah, that was terrible. They, oh. That stayed in my mind, bruv. <laughs> Remember when I had that shit after the Lebanese food? That was, like, last year. And then I had the shit, and I was like, bro, that stinks like Michael, <laughs> Swear it down. No, don't say that stinks like Michael. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's, that it stinks smells like, like his arsehole that one time. You know what I mean? Bro? I remember exactly what you're talking about. <laughs> there was uproar there. There was uproar in the camp. I had a bad shit. <laughs> From a bad shit. It Something terrible. died in me. It was bad. I must have swallowed an animal when I was eating my, it was bad. Eating my food. What animal would you... It, what animal would you be if you if if you had to be an animal? If you had to be an animal, eagle, an eagle. Yep. Yeah, probably the same. King of the air. I'm the king of the air. Yeah. So I, I'm I'm genuinely when I'm up here, no, you can't touch me. I'm yeah, good true. in the air. And when you dive, and when I dive down, I ain't spending much time either. I'm just coming down. That's the fastest animal in the world. Peregrine falcon, isn't it? Peregrine falcon. Is the is the fastest what? Animal in the world. Peregrine falcon. Is it? Yeah, because it can dive at a speed of like 150. It can dive at a speed of 150. Something like that. Let me Google it quickly. I'm sure it can. That, yeah, like, so technically the cheater is, but, yeah, if, we're so, yeah, che but if we're actually talking like... Statistically like, what's recorded yeah, as the fastest because they die. And, and they get a mouse yeah. and then come back up. And to be fair, uh, they've got the power, they've got gravity on their side, everything that. They're just... Yeah, it's true. It's true. Falcon speed. I want to check that. Um, Let's fact check that. 390 kilometers an hour. What's that? 200 miles an hour. Imagine that hitting you, bruv. Yeah. Gone. You're Whatever gone, it's picking bro. up, it's just that quick, well. just... <laughs> yeah. In and out. Yeah, I'd be, I'd, I'd be an eagle, though. I would, I, would like, I would like to go fucking... Um, like, have a proper safari. In it, do you know what? I saw... I saw uh, who done it? Do you remember when Beta... Did you ever watch that video when Beta went to... Um, they, they teamed up. Really good project, by the way. If you haven't watched it, they teamed up with... I can't remember the company's name, so I'm not going to say it. Uh, to build uh, wells, or was it water? Like was to supply water, water to villages, basically. Is it water aid? I can't. Rem I genuinely can't remember. Oh. And they went on a safari tour, bro. It looked so good that I really, from then, that was on my bucket list. South like, Africa looked like they'd do a good safari. They would do a good yeah. safari. But then, like, it's just risky because what if the cheater actually goes for your saying or the lion? How? The, well, obviously, they must have like some sort of safety precaution because, bro, the cars are like open, like they're just open jeeps, and yeah, I know. You could just. But like, they've if, obviously got a gun. And that, yeah, it? but if they come for you. You're fucked. You're fucked. For the, yeah. By the time, I, like, they're so close to the car. And on top of that, I see, like, elephants running after the whip and that. And I know. Like, Fuck. Have you seen Bear Man Online saying that there was a trend going around saying how they do a kangaroo? You would not punch up a kangaroo, you wouldn't, bruv. You wouldn't punch up a kangaroo. They're massive, bruv. And their legs. You would so not do a kangaroo. We, we was literally talking about this a few weeks ago. Remember yeah. that video of the geezer punching the kangaroo? She's got his dog. Yeah, remember that? What a vid, did it? That goes down in history, yeah. that vid. Because the kangaroo proper squared up to yeah, him. Words, so was that, yeah, come on. And they look like what's man the, them, bro. What's the film? It's an old, it's a movie, but the kangaroo CGI, yeah? What film is that? Where oh. they, it's, it's about the kangaroo. Do you remember what film that is, Lara? No, because it's in my head and I can't remember And he what speaks, is. he's Australian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's got boxing gloves on. Yeah, yeah. What? Or am I thinking of Scooby-Doo? No, it's not scooby you know, when Scrappy, am I thinking of that? Wait, hold on. You know, remember that film though? When they go to Haunted Island. It might Island. be Scooby-Doo. I used to think, what's her name? Not Velma, the other one. I think I used to think she was a salt. Uh, Patty. No, no. Is her name no, Patty? Pa no, Patty was uh, Simpsons. Velma and the one in the purple you're talking about. Because Velma was... Velma's fit now though. Velma, <laughs> See, Velma was in the orange and then there was another one. Yeah, Daphne. Daphne. Daphne was a salt, bruv. Daphne. Daphne was a salt, bruv. Velma though, she'd hold it. Yeah, yeah, she actually would. <laughs> But I've got a few questions here that I like 
stupidly like what would be rather it's basically like a what you rather okay um because if we're keeping it a buck a lot of stuff that's happened this month is very like just we just don't want to go on it yeah like, it's dark. especially not even a thing that you're thinking it could be like even just with other stuff in the news right now it's just very we just want some good gray energy. area we want some good energy do you know what i'm saying we don't want to talk about bad stuff so we're just gonna have a little light-hearted episode do you know what i mean um because the stuff that's going on in the news all around is just very shit at the minute <sighs> you know i mean it's just it's just not going to talk about it to be honest um what would the title of your autobiography be if you had an autobiography the man behind the music Wow. You thought about that before. No, I didn't. It? Genuinely, did. I thought of it now. Nah, I swear to God. Nah. I swear to God. I thought about it just now. He's, he's On my that mother's lap. It's too perfect. That's banging. The man behind the music. Yeah. And it will literally be an autobiography about me and how much I've done behind the scenes for music and genuinely what how people wouldn't put pieces together to know this, that, that. What would, Sick. What would I, uh, the man behind the music. I was going to say the man, I was just going off you the man behind the mask because the character. Because the character. But it's not really a mask, yeah, is it? One of my You're trying to jump on my wave, yeah, though. Word. I'm going to take it. <laughs> take it and blow from it. Man behind the mask. Imagine I see you come up with that like next year. I'm like, oh, fuck it. Oh. Uh, what my old biography? How. How touching kids <laughs> what boosted the fuck? my career. Playing a nonce. How playing a nonce boosted my career. Yeah. The old biography of Nigel Watson. <laughs> The real Nigel Watson. Nah, and it's like a picture of like him and then me. <laughs> <laughs> the real Nigel Watson. I don't even know why. Uh, uh. Alright. What is the stupidest reason you've ever got in trouble? When when I got uh when I got a DUI. That was what that was the oh, stupidest yeah, reason stupid. I got in trouble. That was a stupid I'm thing. I'm not even gonna tell you a lot about and, and I, I can I can Mr. talk Michael Hammond. I could talk you through the night as well, just to like, I didn't want to Have go Have you out. spoke about this before? No. Have I've spoken o- about it off camera. Oh, right. Yeah. Because I'm going to leave out yeah, certain yeah, parts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Leave out certain bits, but, yeah. But like... Yeah. Cat in this Look, geezer's first. Long story <laughs> short, yeah. No, bro, I had just broke up with my with my girl at the time. So he was... It wasn't... No, it wasn't... The, it wasn't... The, he was the, outside. It wasn't the, the, the road man girlfriend. It was before her. It was, a, it was an ex before that. And... The boys were trying to invite me out and I was in my bed like, nah, just leave me, yeah. let me just recover, whatever. I'm not even going to go into the journey of how we got there, whatever. We got there and we got there mad early. These lot are pouring shots down my throat, blah, blah, blah. Trying to get me waved, this, that and the other. But you know when you're, I know people have experienced this before, that that kind of, oh, let's get over your heartbreak kind of thing. Like, oh, let's yeah. get you better kind of yeah. situation. So I wasn't mentally okay, but I was trying to get through the night. Yeah. So I was doing, I was thinking irrationally, you know? I've come out the out of the club. It's like four a.m. in the morning. The, the 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 two guys I was with were like, "I'm getting a hotel. I'm getting a hotel. Whatever not." They had things as well, so yeah. it's just like, "Oh, dead." Whatever not. Um, me, I'm standing outside the the club thinking, "I need to fix something up." Yeah, I need to fix something up. Anyway, my boy lived about five minutes away, literally from the club, five minutes away. Mm. So I spotted a woman. That I let's just say I wouldn't usually <laughs> go for. Like that's all I'm leaving it at. It's yeah. a woman that I wouldn't particularly say, oh yeah, like this is my type. Yeah. yeah. And I've I've thought over to her and I've said, Yeah, me and you tonight, girl. We're going to my boys' crib. <laughs> me and you tonight, girl. <laughs> and chop chop. S- get to the motor. To say, she had no arguments. She's she looking at me, and I'm not blowing my trumpet, I'm just saying as the woman I would, wouldn't usually go for. Yeah. And she she asked, she was like, what, like for real, bro? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Big Come on. Big MH. Man behind the music. About to give you the love, it's, the, it's Big MH. It's Hamilton, man. It's Hamilton. Yeah, not joking. So, so MTBM. yeah. MTBM. The- <laughs> man behind the music. Command the MBTM. Music. MBTM. Yeah, that's cool. That's your number plate. That's, that's my number, number plate. plate. MBTM. Facts. So, so boom. Um, she's now... What was I going to say? She said, she, wait, you're not drink driving. She, oh, no. Nah, oh, no, nah, no. Nah. Well, we she, can go shop if you want she, and get some vodka. She knew, she knew I was off it, whatever not. But then I was drunk. The two, my two boys that I was with were like, Michael, please. Like, just. You must have you, been smashed. Didn't what it? are you doing with this? Don't, don't do whatever <laughs> not. I was like, I'm, I'm like, boys, I'm in the car door. Like, come, babe, get in the car. Get in the car. I'm like, to the, to the, to the boys. Roasting. Move from the car door. 
Shut the car Top door. Dripping my pre yeah. in it, like ready to go. Turn the car door. I'm driving to my boy's house. I've got from the car park, genuinely, you lot, from the car park, just outside by a roundabout, pulled straight away. I was in the car for no longer than 25 seconds. Really? Straight probably, away. Yeah, and I, I was mean, so it's grateful. Long you got nicked, but it's probably for the best reason. I was, I was, I was yeah. eternally grateful. I said to the police officer when I got to the station, and bear in mind, they were, they were really nice because I gave up straight away and they were like, look, the official breathalyzer that you're going to take is in, is, gonna, is in the police station. That is what gets you your license taken. So either what we're going to do is we're going to take mad long to process you. They, they stuck me. Why? Because the, then I can sober up and then they can do the breathalyzer. Why would they want to do that though? Because they were trying to help me. Oh, is it? Yeah, they was like, look, if you, if you take some hours to sober up, then we do the breathalyzer. If Badge number. If you're under, if you're under, we let you go. So I was like, sweet. They, what, why have they done that? I was being nice to them. Yeah, but still, that's a touch. It's a touch. Every police officer I've encountered has been an absolute wanker. He, they was both trying to help me, both trying to help me. And I said to him, look, even if it don't get, if it don't go that way, it's cool, but it didn't go that way. And um, I was like, look, you taught me a mad lesson. I was like, I will never, never, you ever do this again. You've had a touch. I don't know. No, but, no, but I, I still got it. Still got a ban? Yeah, because because I was still over. <laughs> oh, you're still over. I was still, I was, so they give you a chance. And they you gave me fucked. a chance, and I was still that. Do you remember what your up. reading was? It was way over. Way over, yeah. It was way over. So <laughs> I like it wasn't even close. So yeah, and and it just taught me a lesson. To, obviously, I was really young these times, guys, yeah. and I was immature. So um, yeah, I've never done it again. I never will do it again. So I think it's what I needed. Yeah. You know I've I mean? never, I don't drink drive too fast. I know a couple people that do when they've had a few and they think they're all right. I can see how if you, I'm not condoning it. Like if you, you're going to get your license taken off, it's not even worth it. Or you could do something worse yeah, and you kill someone. Do, you could hurt I know people that have died in car crashes. Else. You know what I mean? It's not, it's really not worth it. If you don't think you, I don't get the people that are absolutely battered and oh, I can drive. What is going on? All them ones that head? do fucking balloons, bro. Have when you seen drive, them? Old... Drive? <laughs> yeah. My God. That's, that's, if anything, that's a huge risk. Yeah, man. Can't lie. I don't it, like to be fair, if I go out on a night out and I'm driving, it kind of because I know in the back of my head my car's outside, I won't even have one. Because gonna, why are you gonna have the one? Point? What's the what's the actual point? I don't like drinking unless I'm getting drunk. Yeah. I don't like the taste Having of Having a little tip really. for no reason is a bit dead, isn't it? Do you know what so I mean? you're gonna go out and, and send it or just don't drink. Quaver bum. Bear quaver bum, bro. <laughs> like you got quaver bum and then you got skips <laughs> cock. In it. Skips do actually smell like cock though, I can't lie. <laughs> Am I wrong? I lie. In it, skip this smell like cock. Next time you get a right. Right, next time in the shop, yeah. Honestly, boys, yeah. But and girls, if you know what a prick smells like, yeah, next time you go into a shop, yeah, get a packet of skips and open them and sniff. It smells like Belend. Telling you, they don't taste like it, but they smell like Belend. Hey, Quaver Bomb is Quaver Bomb, cheesy bottle, isn't it? I'm gonna start giving you nicknames and winging it. Oh, oh look, there's Mark Cheesy ass. <laughs> hey, easy triple cheese. <laughs> That's his new nickname, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, Quaver Bum. They start, they, it starts becoming a thing on the wing, isn't it? Oh, next time I get fucking searched, I'm going to make some arsehole stinking. <laughs> isn't it? There's like a meter on how much you condensated up the mirror. Isn't it? Condensate up and put a smiley face in it. <laughs> Dead. Oh, it's got me that one. <laughs> Look at I'm in bits. <laughs> um, all right, cool. Let's go on to another question. Quaver Bum is crazy. I'm still... <sighs> <sighs> go on, what's the next one? Okay. Hmm. <sighs> Yeah. What's the most embarrassing thing you've witnessed me doing and vice versa? Oh my God. <sighs> Let me think. What is, uh, but that, okay, surely let's think. Have you got one in mind? For, for, no, I'm not, Cause you haven't done anything embarrassing in front of me. I'm thinking. Do you know what I mean? But we spent bare time, we've gone holidays, we've done this. That's what I'm thinking, that. holidays. I'm trying to think holidays. I could think of Kenny. <laughs> yeah, I can think of Kenny. I think of Kenny. I can think of Kenny, but I, I, in fact, I've got proof. <laughs> yeah, I've I got can think of Kenny, But I can't, I can't think of us. Um, that's too hard, Johnny. I feel like, or is there a situation that we've gone through together that's embarrassing? No. Nah. I say most I've done in, nah, probably when I took that shit. <laughs> Yeah, it's not really embarrassing. Probably the most it just stinks, bruv. I don't know, what have I done that's embarrassing? You see, when, see when you get these questions on pods and that, it's like, what's the most it's, embarrassing it's, moment? It's too hard to it's think It's hard about. to think of a target one until it comes to you and then you're like, oh shit, Unless yeah. it was like a really big thing that we've like landmarked in our head. Yeah. There's not really anything yeah. that embarrassing. Not really. You know what I mean? Can't lie. Go on, next one. All right. 
Oh, mate, sorry about the burping people. <laughs> They've been commenting about that. Okay, <laughs> have they? Yeah. They really? Yeah, they said- I listen, I've got problems, mate. They said the burping and the heavy breathing is something you go- <laughs> Do I heavy breathe? <laughs> Do I? Oh, because I burp, then I- Yeah, you go-, I go, you go <laughs> And I breathe nah, out, yeah, yeah, apologies. I can't <laughs> help it. Like, I've got bad, he's got bad a gut, acid he's got, reflux or he's got, he's got a gut, gut problem with you lot. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, <laughs> which one of our inside jokes is your favourite? We got some dark humour, man. Yeah, I, I, I don't even think that can... We got some dark humour, man. Genuinely, it's our... Some of the things this geezer messages me, yeah. <laughs> mate, I think, bro, if I didn't have that humour, I'd... Yeah, you'd probably go for, you'd probably go, go for me. Yeah, yeah. mad. Legit. Like, I, I, <laughs> oh, we can't even... Can we even... I know what you're thinking about in yeah, your head. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I know exactly what you're Hey, bleep it, Lara, how about this year? I posted a picture of my four-year-old niece on my story in a bikini, yeah? He replied to it, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I hear it. I hear Johnny's it. Like, I hear it. No. You just got to, yeah, you just got to double down, innit? If someone says a really dark joke, oh, you got to so, double down. That's so dark. Yeah, that's bad dog. That's dark. That's dark. Yeah, that's that one there. Can't say that one. Yeah, no, is it? Dark. Hey, bleep it. Yeah, bleep it. But bleep the thing it. is though, is that yeah, do bleep it. But the thing is though, is that just annoying. Is that on camera, I wouldn't want to say something like that. But to anyone, anyone in real life, I can't. I'd say it. Yeah, and I'd back myself. But when online, you don't have a like. Once you have your say, that's it. The whole world. Has yeah, it. yeah, yeah. Because eh. more time, if there was none of this. It'd be, no, it'd, be, it'd be nice and it's normal. It's a joke. Because like, half we, the we, people that are watching this probably have the darkest humour Yeah, they probably, probably laugh at it, bro. If, if they've come from me and they haven't just joined the pod, they, they know they, what they, I'm they on. They've got dark humour. Yeah, they, they know your humour. Do you know what I'm saying? So, you know, but we can't talk about it. But yeah, just say that we have very, very dark humour. Yeah, I would say our favourite, um, my favourite humour is just how we will joke about anything. Any little thing. Anything. No matter how serious it is, we'll make a joke about it. Because I can't lie, that's the, probably the best part of I it. Know. Like making a light-hearted thing of Someone a bad situation. Someone could die in it. Charge yeah. it. Yeah, legit. Yeah, hold that, man. Hold that, man. Don't have to give him that money now. <laughs> but you're obviously not being. You're not, serious. You're not being serious. You, you know, know what I mean? mean? Like God, like obviously, whatever, whatever bad happens, what we pray over each other, we make sure we're good. Like you know what I mean? If anything, anything bad happens to Johnny, I'm sad about it, bro. I'll go through it with him. You get me? But then dashing a little like. It's like the thing how a lot know, of people <laughs> can't take. A joke. And even if I said to you, your mum, some 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 people Some can't. people don't play with that, yeah. Some people don't play with that. Like I'm personally insulting your mum. I'm not. Yeah. You know what I mean? Call my mum a whole I couldn't give a fuck. Yeah. You know what I mean? I know you don't mean it. And it's a joke. You know what I mean? I don't, you gotta got be inside my circle to do that though. No, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Don't come up to me and Don't come up to Johnny and, and say like, oh yeah. No, I probably won't chin you, I'll just violate you. Yeah, back. yeah, fact. And then if it gets heated, it gets heated. Yeah. <laughs> okay, go What's on. the most outrageous thing you have done for love or a friendship? Ah, oh, no, man. What? Not John Bay. It's God. Yeah. 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 Yeah, that was stupid. <laughs> what else have I done for love that's stupid? I feel like when you get your first love, you, just, you don't even I'm rate trying yourself. To think, when, you're, when you're actually younger and you... you first, why is my hair doing that? It looks like devil horns. Um, I feel like when you're younger, like, you just get so loved up, bruv. Like, you see, bear man go through this phase where... No, like, I just let people do it now, like, see certain people get onto boys when they, they they first get a girlfriend and they stop coming out. Like, I get it, it's annoying, but at the same time, everyone goes through it. Like, if it's your first love, for six months, you're gone. You're out of there. You're out, you're not even coming out. And that's just a lot of the time how it is because you're so invested in that person. Mm. And, uh, do you know what I mean? Let them be, man. Do you know what I mean? But then don't expect to just fucking, don't just brush your mates. Yeah. Because at the end of the day, when push comes to shove, your mates are there, the, the bird ain't there. Or, or the fella. Like, or the fella, yeah, opposite. Or yeah. Whatever you. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, I think, I don't, to be fair, I don't think I've done anything mad like that, you know? To be fair, whatever. With my toxic ex, I think I just got violated, but stayed. That was the only maddest thing I've done because I wanted her to stay with me. Uh, to be fair, embarrassing question. That's an embarrassment. What? That you stayed with her. If we was going to say Yeah. Anything. But other than that. Yeah. Then, that other than that, I don't know what else. Yeah, stay stay with my bad ex. Well, what would be embarrassing for me? She took years off me life. Oh my God. <laughs> I don't know. I think your one is not joining Beta Squad. Yeah, it is. 
That is stupid. Isn't it? No, I've done for a loved one. What have I done for a friend that's stupid? Back, back to the love thing, yeah, because I just want to talk about that. Like, when people get in a relationship young, they do go incognito and they do go ghost. But it's because they're, they're invested in that person. But, like, so I know some people that, but it's more girls. Like, a girl will have no mates. And only, only chill like, with a fella. Chill with a f yeah, bro. And and that's that, a bit that's, intense no, for me, it man. No, because it is, because her whole life is about you. So the intense, moment you, bruv. you can't even slip off with your mates because she's literally just, her whole life is just surrounded by you. And that, yeah. to me, I think that's a big red flag, you know? Yeah, no, well, when I was younger, I lived with my ex, so it's I know, like, yeah, it, yeah. but I didn't realize that it was intense. It's I mean, intense, she would never bro. say I can't go out with my friends, but like, I would feel bad, bad. for doing That's it. That's what I'm saying. Whereas now, I'm a grown man. It's like, it ain't that. Like, I need I need you to be going out. If we're with your mates, I want you to have mates. I've got to have my mates. Yeah. Because it's good, it's good to have that space, bro. And on top of that, like, I want to... With me, I think a big thing for me is I want a chance to miss my girl. Don't... Mm. I don't want to be like this. I can't yeah. do that. I can't yeah, be... I can't do that anymore. No. Join that they hit with you. Genuinely, I can't. It's just not my style. Some people like it. I hear you. I hear that. But me personally, allow me. Like yeah. if I see you every few days, buzzing. If I see you once or twice a week, even even happier. Cool. Obviously, that's subject to change. Yeah, of course. As course, shit goes course. on, and we and it shouldn't be like a. It's not a regime. It's, it's not, not a regime. Yeah. It's just. It's just like you can you can split it up any way you want, but don't be with me every strike and second of the yeah, fucking day. Just I can't like, do like it if now. I'm going if I'm going somewhere like because there is some. Um, there's lots, there's loads of people where their girlfriend would just come in from everywhere, yeah. and it's like I don't care if you're if I'm out with my boys and his girlfriend's there. It don't bother me, innit? Yeah, but yeah. it's just like there's a difference, though. There is a difference. There is. A I difference. know he's not fully, fully, fully relaxed because you're always caring you've about got to someone care about else. His missus or... You have to, and you, I, I know the way I am. I care about yeah. if we're in a relationship. So I'll be sitting there thinking, does she want to go? Does she, that, or it's is, just just in general, is she alright? Sometimes right. you just have a little look round. Yeah, you're like, right. Yeah, you're good. And yeah. that, for me, it, although on the front side of things, yeah, nothing's actually wrong. It's just yeah. that you can't fully unwind. Yeah. But you boys, mean? you need boy time. I can't lie. You need it, and man. girls, you need girl time. Boys, both, you, both, you need both it, of us man. need it, yeah. Like, boys and girls, you should let your partner go on holiday. Yes. Can't lie. It's mad toxic, this generation, bruv. Cheating is so normalized. It makes you feel sick, bruv. It's disgusting. It's actually disgusting. That's bro. why we're so restricted. I feel like I'm going to be single forever, bruv. I can't lie. Because there's not, nothing fits me right now. I can't nothing lie, I fits me, bruv. And the way I see people move, Mental, oh, dark, dark. Mental, bruv. Like it means nothing anymore. The it means nothing anymore. Relationship time. Don't mean not, don't mean it means nothing, bruv. It's disgusting, bruv. But yeah, you gotta have. You gotta let your. Uh, there's two places. I think we spoke about this before. Two places I won't let my girl go. Yeah, where was it again? Marbella Bank Marbella. Holiday Weekend. Yeah. I'd say, why do you even want to go there? <laughs> why? Just why do you want to go there? Go Marbella. Bear. Come. Why are you going Bank Holiday? Bear brothers. You're and just getting ready. grabbed up left, right, and yeah, center, yeah. bruv. It's like not a little carnival in yeah, my bed. Yeah, it's like <laughs> even if even if even if you're not even if you're not doing nothing wrong. They're coming though. They hit the, the, the there. Yeah, the predators are out. Yeah, it's like whoosh, casting yeah, a line in. in it and just reeling it in, isn't it? As fast as possible, get away. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Where else did I say? You said two phases, but I can't remember. You didn't say beefer, did you? Nah, I don't mind what beefer. Yeah. Dubai? Yeah. Um, I think it's just that weekend, that bank holiday weekend. You did say because I know places, every I boy remember. in London goes there to chop. Yeah, it's That's, it's literally it's turning to I've never been, but it turns into some scatty. It's not. It's dark. Yeah, that weekend does not put a good light on Marbella. Do you know what I mean? That is literally like I've, yeah, that is a cop the, hood, the hood takes over. Yeah, it's gets, London. It's London, hood, in, London in London in Marbella still. Yeah, it literally is. I swear down. It's full of just trappers there. and gangbangers. They're sin over there. Yeah. <laughs> during that weekend yeah word <laughs> just probably is lit though I can't know probably I, I, I've i never been but yo the I've been marbles the, normally but the I boys that I told me yeah they said yeah man them yeah it's a hey, doggy doggy dog world. I think what? marbles is cheaper than beef now as well really it's villas are but cheaper in Marbella Mar marbles is v pricey. villas in Marbella are cheaper than uh, villas in our beef are. a million okay. percent fair like I've I've looked at villas in Marbella and villas in beef and uh, from like a same concierge and it's always cheaper in my way. Fair. Like, our beef is getting so it's expensive. Trumpy, it's trumpy. Getting very expensive. Literally, I would, the it's last bougie time I was, now. What, two years ago. Our beef is bougie now. It was mad expensive. Bougie. They got a Nusrat there now. Nusrat. Is it? They got a Zuma there Nusrat now. Right and a Zuma. We've got a Zuma there now. Mental, Fair. Bro. They're trying to do it up like yeah. that. They've got, obviously, in St. Joseph and at the Bear Villas that you can rent out. 
Like there's like it's, it's become, gonna, it's becoming it a flexy that. thing. Yeah yeah yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I do like it though. I don't want it to be Malia. I want it. I yeah, do no, of course. You want it to be a bit more upstairs. Yeah, like, I do, it, I do. Because you know there's some there's some toilet party destinations. Oh there. my god. Like, you na- couldn't pay na- me Napa, to go like Zanti, fucking uh, Magalu. No, it's a toilet still. It's a toilet. It's, it's a, a toilet. toilet. The club stink. Like, t- the where's club like, stink. B- like beef you know, Oh, it's just disgusting, yeah. So I remember for my 18th birthday, yeah. Fucking um, I went on a family holiday to Ibiza. Before okay. I knew what Beefa was about, really. I knew it was obviously the club capital, but like yeah, the yeah, world, yeah. but like, I didn't really, I loved house music, but I weren't like a, yeah, wasn't solid I'd done raving and all raving shit like that, that, but not like, I weren't like a, in there, in there. Probably, you know what yeah. I mean? I was still quite young. I was a young 18 year old. People grow up quicker nowadays, don't they? Yeah. Um, but anyway, yeah, went Beefa. I um, think two of my mates were 18 with me. And then like, obviously Joe was 16. Then like there's people that 16, 17. So they could, we assumed they couldn't get in the clubs before they were gonna check ID. So we didn't even try it. So we just went on the strip. Yeah. Yeah. And the strip is scatty, bruv. Okay. Ship and I be for scatty, yeah. So we went in uh China Whites, I think it was. Yeah. Yeah. And so where we're younger and we've never really been in a club and that, because obviously I'm I'm one of the oldest in my friendship group. So as a boy, I look young anyway. Mm. Like there's no chance I'm getting a fake ID and getting in a club. So I hadn't even been clubbing, really. Right. So, you know, then once, like I I turned I 18. That week in Ibiza. Right, right, right. So like right. previously, I'd never been, never out, been out. out. You know what I mean? Yeah. Only pub and that, like, do you know what I mean? Right. So fucking, anyway, you know, when they go, oh, I'll give you a bottle, free shots, da, all, da, 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 all that stuff. Yeah. Like, yeah, cool. He bring it over in a big ice, like, kind of like grey goose bucket thing. Yeah. With like bare Red Bulls in there. Yeah, yeah. Vodka, know the you know yeah, what yeah. I'm talking yeah, about, yeah. yeah. So us not thinking about no sort of hygiene, literally took all the Red Bulls out, all the vodka out, Use that ice bucket, tip the vodka and every bit of Red Bull in there, and we're just scooping up with the cups. <laughs> and I and I think about it now. That think, is so fucking. That is so. That disgusting. is disgusting. The ice and the dirt. That's, that's, that's disgusting. And we just left it on the side of the club. <laughs> and we just go up to it and scoop up from the dance floor when we wanted to. That is trampy, bro. That what is so doing, trampy. Bro? That's a, that's I remember I thinking I was a baller. I remember we had a bottle of Prosecco, bro, sparkling <laughs> wine. And I, I think I've, I've got a picture on my Insta, actually. <laughs> No way, yeah. Jay. I got shades nah. on. Oh, I'm out my you nut. Know, I actually hey, weren't. That's disgusting, bro. That's disgusting. So just... <laughs> it's disgusting, bro. Look, emptied all the Red Bulls in. I, I put a picture on my Insta and everything. I was flexing with you a bottle just of sparkling wine. Scooping, scooping the fucking drink out of my mouth. Life. Disgusting. Hey, right, that is. Hey, y'all look. Flexing a bottle of Prosecco. <laughs> 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 oh my days, bruv. Oh, look, don't know why I'm uploading these. Just going through pitch for my beef, bro. We are mashed. 2016. <laughs> we bro. are mashed. State of me, bruv. You nah, Jamie, see that. Look, what look at the year, bottle on flexing, bruv. It's sparkling wine. It probably costs like four quid, bruv. Look, hey. we got another one with the bottle of sparkling wine. Yeah, come on, let me, let me see it. Bottle of shampoos, boy. But that was the night. <laughs> that was the night. Look at the state of the colour of uh, my cousin's drink. That's just oh, it up. It was a mix of Fanta, Red Bull, and vodka, just all in a bucket. It just looks black. What is that? It looks black. Yeah, it literally looks black. The drink's black. That's disgusting. Look. Man. Disgusting. <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> it ta- you- I think it, it, them clubs have like a smell of like, you know when you piss in a urinal and the little thingy in there? It smells like that. The whole club. You know? I hear it. Just- and all it is is music like, put your hands up and they stay there. Ooh. I don't Shit know. Music, a bunch bro. of top 40s and then, and then just the club bangers. I hear it. Just yeah, me. man. Yeah, man. But um, yeah. I feel yeah. like what was feel it? like we'll fucking end it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it was good to be, good to be back. I feel like we haven't recorded for a bit. No, but we've been I'm consistent, gonna... huh? Yeah, we, we are being consistent. We are being consistent. Yeah, mate. Um, but yeah, if you enjoyed this episode, please give a like. Um, let us know what you want to talk about because I'll be real. I'll keep it real. Obviously, we're trying to get um guests on, but obviously the guests we we're, we're very particular about guests. We want to get guests on that we actually know. I don't know why. Yeah. More time. I want to know them. Yeah. Just so you can make the convo flow a bit easier. Yeah, anyway. But even if you do want guests on, let us know, um, who, you let us know who you want on. And yeah. we'll just do it anyway. Yeah, we'll do it anyway. Yeah, but let us know some ideas what you're just going to talk about. Because we just waffle on. And sometimes, I don't know, we just get in our own head and start thinking, we're just talking shit that people actually enjoy this. Yeah. But we'd, nice. yeah, we'd like to have some actual topics and shit like that. Um, yeah. But yeah, man. Enjoyed the video. Like it. Like appreciate it. it. Comment, See you later. Uh, take care. <laughs>